Good morning. It is April 1st, 2020. I do not have a clever April Fool's prank to pull on you, but my shoes are untied. So, AI Dungeon. We said we were going to do it. It's April 1st. April AI, same letters. So let us do the playthrough of the AI Dungeon. And of course, of our choices, fantasy, mystery, apocalypse, zombies. Apocalypse and zombies are kind of the same thing, guys. Cyberpunk, also apocalypse, zombies, cyberpunk, kind of the same thing. And custom, we're going to chart with fantasy. So, we intro one, and we press enter, and see what happens. Do I want to be a noble, a knight, a squire, a wizard, a ranger, a peasant, or a rogue? Of course, I want to be a ranger. I'll be a ranger, yeah. Enter my character's name. Uh, what are we going to call my character? We'll call him Steve. Generating story. Please wait. This should be interesting. How long before I either break the game or die? You are Steve, a ranger living in the kingdom of Lorien. You have a hunting bow and a quiver of arrows. You spot the deer are ready to finish your hunt when suddenly you hear a voice behind you. Hey, I thought we were supposed to be doing this later, a familiar voice says. I was about just about to head off on my own little mission. Look to see who is talking to me. You turn around and see an old man with white hair wearing leather armor holding two swords. He looks like he could easily kill anyone if they got too close to him. Oh, hey. Hi, Fred. What is your mission? I guess his name is Fred. He smiles at you as he walks over to you. So, you're one of those people that's been following me for a while now, he asks. Yeah, you reply. Because I want to go fishing with you, Fred. The old man nods his head. Well then, let's go get some fish, he tells you. Walk to Lake with old man. You follow the old man into the woods where you both sit down and talk about everything that has happened since you first met each other. Man, that is a lot of fish considering we are in the woods, sir. Question mark. Old man, oh yes, it is quite the place. There are many different kinds of animals here, including bears, wolves, and even dragons. We, sh we need to make sure we don't miss anything, though. Dragons? Question mark, exclamation point. Old man, yes, dragons. We should probably keep our eyes open for any of the sensations. Creatures, though, though, me, what do you mean? Are there any dragons nearby, sir? Question mark. Old man, no, not yet anyways. The last time we saw one was back in the day when they still lived underground. Oh, okay. Then, no worries. Let's do our job and look for the fish-stealing bandits. I don't know where that one came from, but let's see. Remember, the goal here is to either break the game or, I don't know. Old man, well, maybe next year or so, but not today. Right now, though, we need to decide which way we want to go. You, which way? Okay. Okay, let's go north to the bandit 
cave because you know arresting those bandits is our job as rangers question mark Five minutes in, and we haven't had anything happen yet. Old man, that would be correct. However, you think I think you should stay here and help me patrol this area. Okay, let's patrol the area, as that is our job. Question mark. Old man, all right, all right, I'll take care of things here. Just remember to report any problems to me immediately afterwards. Goodbye. You leave the office and start walking towards the forest. I apparently was in an office. I thought we were in the forest. Okay, office. Say goodbye to Pam, because we're in the office, and head to the forest to look for the fish bandits. Pam, because, you know, we're in the office. Pam, 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 Pam. Pam, goodbye, stranger. I hope you find your fortune soon. You, thanks, Pam. See you later. Pam, question mark. Stranger, question mark. We have worked together for five for 15 years, I am one day to retirement. Because, yeah, let's throw that one in. Just need to catch them bandits. Explanation point. You run through the trees and try to avoid being seen by anyone else. But <laughs> what happened to Pam? After an hour of running, you finally reach a small stream where you hear voices coming from behind some rocks. Okay, look behind rocks. You hide behind a rock and watch as two bandits enter the stream. They both seem to be armed with spears and daggers. One of them points at you and shouts, Halt! How did they see me if I was hiding? Uh, okay. Uh, raise my hands. Slowly walk towards them. And at the last second period... Draw my sword and say, drop your weapons, weapons, boys, you're going to jail, explanation point. The man raises his spear threateningly. He drops his weapon and turns to you. You, I'm sorry, but I can't let you pass. Take. Take out duct tape and tie them up. Because you got to have duct tape in every setting. Right? Right? Are we still on? You guys... You grab some duct tape and tie it around their arms. You then proceed to handcuff them. As you're doing this, you notice something strange about men. Their eyes seem different. They aren't human anymore. Not human? Explanation point, question part. Are they space vampires? Question mark, explanation point. Because I hate those vampires.
They scream and struggle against the bonds. You don't even bother trying to calm them down. You just continue trying their wits together until they stop struggling completely. Okay, so I guess it doesn't matter they're not humans. Duct tape. Duct tape wins. Oh, thank God, as I was one day to retirement. Oh, how is AI doing? Hilarious, great, seems broken, offensive, repetitive. Uh, let's do great. Afterwards, you return home and tell everyone, tell everyone what happened. Your wife. What the hell did you do? Did you really use duct tape on their necks? No, I used duct tape on their wrist. And how could you possibly believe that they were actually human? Your, your son. Dad, we've got to go check on our friends now. You. No, no, we should wait until after dinner. Let's eat, get some food first before checking on him again. Because obviously food is more important than our friend. Because food is more important than friends, even if <laughs> period eat dinner. You sit down at the table with your family and eat dinner. It tastes delicious, especially since you made sure to buy fresh vegetables today. The next morning, you wake up early and prepare yourself for tomorrow's adventures. The next morning, you wake early and prepare yourself for tomorrow's adventures. So... But today, I retire. After... 25 years as a ranger, man and boy, I can finally put down my star and spend my days with my wife. Pam. You. Well, well, uh, it seems like someone has been watching us lately. Wife, huh? Who? Where? When? Why? The damn fish-stealing vampires won't let me rest. Seems I got one job left, hun. Period. Don't wait up. That sounds right, Rangery. Pant. But I need sleep. Wife. Hannah. You're right. You know how much fun we had yesterday. Whoa. You stole enough money from those idiots to pay off our mortgage. What? <laughs> I stole money? Question mark. Question mark. I stole money? Money? Pam? Question mark. And my name is not... Pam. Pam has obviously lost her mind. Have you lost your mind, Pam? 14 minutes in and we're still alive! You. Hiccup. Oh, uh, yeah. I think so. Wife. Oh, my God. This isn't funny. You, look, if you want to call me another name, then fine. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Role playing is fine during sexy time, Pam. But right now, period, I have fish stealing vampires to deal with. Explanation point. 
grab my sword and bow. Are you serious? Me. Yes, I'm serious. Now come on, let's go. Wife, but why would you do such a thing? Well, it's my last day at work and I cannot put down my star till those dang fish stealing vampire are behind bars. All right, all right, fine, we'll go. You, come on, hurry up. Why am I bringing my wife with me to go kill vampires? We head out to town and soon reach the outskirts of a small village. 17 minutes in, we're going 20 minutes. 20 minutes for our first try. After that, I think you're gonna get bored of me and 20 minutes is a good try. So 17 minutes. All right, small village. At last, vampire village explanation point let's get some vampires pam me hey there what's going on a few villagers look at you suspiciously. They don't seem to understand why you'll be talking to them so freely in front of others. Arrest all the villagers. You, all the villagers are dead. They were killed by vampires. Villager, vampires? That's impossible. They're supposed to be extinct. Well, you're dead, and you're talking to me, so, period, vampires, question mark, exclamation point. Me, no, 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 these people weren't vampires, they died of natural causes, but you still shouldn't talk about it so openly in public. Villager, natural colleges, natural causes. So the villagers are dead. The villagers are talking to me. And now the villagers were killed by natural colleges. Yes, the volcano. Why are you talking to me, dead villager? Uh, why not throw it a volcano? 19 minutes to 32 seconds. Look, I'm sorry for disturbing you, but this topic is very important to me. Villager number three. Really? So what exactly happened? Were you attacked or something? No, you all died in a volcano. And look, now there are vampire fish stealing dinosaurs and it's 
all your fault. And I was one day to retirement. No, 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 it wasn't my fault. The volcano erupted and caused all these deaths. 20 minutes. All right, we're going to end our first adventure in AI Dungeon. There, we did not break it, but we definitely confused it. We went from hunting with an old man to trying to go fish. There were no fish. I threw in fish stealing. Apparently the village, the bandits were actually not human. I thought maybe they were vampires, but they weren't vampires. We'll never find out what the not human bandits wore or why I couldn't go fishing with the old man. Uh, it was one day to retirement because you had to throw in that one day to retirement. And we went to a village to look for the vampires. The villagers were all dead, and yet they still talked to me. And apparently they died of natural causes in a disaster, which was a volcano with dinosaurs. Because why not? So there we go. AI Dungeon Day Number One. We will continue this as long as we can through the month of April, because why not? Tune in later today or tomorrow for more adventures with the AI Dungeon. And if you appreciate this, please take a moment to like, share, subscribe, check out AI Dungeon for yourself, and if you are feeling so inclined, please consider supporting me during these hard times. Till next time, enjoy all your weird adventures during this very weird time, and I will talk to you losers later.